you know, I, I, I really don't think I should present this award to us. And I have somebody that I would really like to present this award to you. And that person is PFC Sean Dasher. <laughs> Cammy, what do you think it is? Mm -hmm. Don't touch it. I don't know. You don't know. You can open it in a minute. Let's wait for Caleb. Did you need to go to the bathroom? We've been driving. Huh? Well, Larry, oh, I'm recording. Oh, are you? <laughs> Come here, Caleb. Come on. Is it for both of us? Yeah. Let's read it. Let's read what it says. It says to Caleb and Cameron, love daddy. What do you think it is, Caleb? It's for both of us. Well, what do you think it is? It's really I, big. I think it's a remote control monster truck. Oh, yeah? Don't touch it. Leave it alone. Open now, it. Are you ready? Yes. You sure? Can open it tonight. Are you sure you want to open it tonight? Uh-huh. Well, we're going to be really thankful for Daddy. Yeah, I am. All right, go ahead and open it. It's for Daddy! <laughs>
A surprise homecoming just in time for Memorial Day. WTOC's Linda Figueredo is joining us from Effingham County, where a member of the Georgia Air National Guard's 117th Air Control Squadron surprised his daughters on their last day of school. It took weeks of planning and a lot of secrecy, but the Horton family says it was worth it as their three daughters were individually surprised by their father today. Please give a warm welcome to Master Sergeant Horton. On the last day of school at Effingham Middle School, Megan Horton thought she was just about to watch the talent show, but it kicked off with a huge surprise. Her dad, Master Sergeant Ray Horton, came home just in time for the last day of school after a six-month deployment. I love you. It, it, it's absolutely wonderful. Um, being gone for six months, missing Christmas and New Year's and, and birthdays that happen, and just being away for six months, this is... This is a homecoming that you dream of. When Master Sergeant Horton saw his baby girl running his way, emotion overwhelmed him. It brought tears to my eyes. I can't lie. Um, this is my baby daughter. So. And the tears wouldn't stop there. Soon after, he arrived at the Effingham County High School to surprise his other daughters. But his eldest, Hannah, found him first. <laughs> Can you do just see me walk by? Yeah. Then the family went to find the middle child, Emily. He was in such shock, she couldn't even hug her father at first. Hey, it was your heart with joy to, to see the happiness that, that you get to see coming home after a long deployment like this. Um, just uh, being able to see their reaction and, and knowing how much they miss me and I've missed them during this time, it's, uh, it's just heart filling. Priceless. Just priceless. Made it all worth it. It wasn't easy for their mother, Martha, to keep the whole surprise a secret. Rough. I've had to <laughs> tell fibs to my kids. <laughs> I told them that he was not coming home for another week. The Horton family plans on spending this Memorial Day together, enjoying their father's homecoming and spending much needed time together on a family vacation. Live in Effingham County, Linda Figueredo, WTOC News. We have some breaking news. Oh my God, you're crying. <laughs> I need to cry. <laughs> Did not expect that. What the heck is that?
Four months ready. <laughs> Is this over already? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. With your 
what is going on? Yay! Hey, Happy birthday, Kurt! I'm sorry, I'm out of here. Happy birthday, Kurt! This will be on YouTube. Bye guys. Have a great day. On our bottom. Really loud, Alexis. Dear evil stepmother, why are you so mean to me? I you a lot nicer to me. You're really mean to me and I don't understand. Put in his face. Do you think she knows this guy? Yeah. Who's coming home? Who's coming home? Who's coming home? Hi, guys. Oh. Hey. Oh. Lord, look at you. Look how small you are. You lost all this weight. Come here, Otto. Otto, come here. Oh, whimper and why? Hi. Look at you. Oh. Hey. <laughs> I see you, I see you don't know what to do, Otto. Turn some circles. This guy, this guy's look great. Whoa. Bandanas on. Hey, yeah, buddy. say we dressed up for daddy. Ford, who is it? Hey. <laughs> oh, <that's so> <laughs> Well, that, well, so that.
Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to direct your attention to the middle of the field. We have a special guest tonight that's going to toss our coin for the opening coin toss. It is uh, Michael Stiles' mother, Misty, who is just home from Afghanistan. And I'd like you to uh, stand with me and give her a hand. This is a surprise to Michael. Juliana, do you want another cup of water? Do you want another cup of water? Yeah? Okay, there's one there for you. <laughs> I missed you so much. You lost it too! Oh my god, I love you. <laughs> what I want you guys to do is turn around and look that way. because me and my brother have spent every Christmas together growing up and this was going to be our first Christmas not together and I turn around and see him and it's just so exciting. What? Yeah. <gasps> Maybe it's that bunny. Yeah. Uh. What? I'm colorblind. 
My turn for a kiss now.